ETA Airways has rolled out its first Airbus A350 in its new signature Savoy Blue Livery. The initial flagship aircraft of the fleet has been named in honour of Italian footballer and head coach Marcello Lippi. The SkyTeam carrier launched the new livery on an Airbus A320 earlier this year, and the new A350-900 is the first of its kind to wear the new colours. The aircraft currently registered as Echo India India Foxtrot Bravo with MSN270 was initially set for Hong Kong Airlines, but never made it into active service. While it's brand new to ETA Airways, the jet is actually now about three and a half years old. The aircraft features a solid blue fuselage, which ETA Airways highlights as a symbol of Italy's unity and pride. The tail empennage and engines are accented in the green, white and red of the Italian flag. The blue invokes Italy's national football and rugby squad, who wear blue in honour of the House of Savoy, under which Italy unified in 1861. The Italian national football team, Gli Azzurri, the Blues, has gone on to win the FIFA World Cup on four occasions. Most recently, in Berlin in 2006 against France with the aircraft's namesake, Marcello Lippi. The recently revamped Italian flag carrier Italia Trasporto Aereo, or ITA, or ITA, is continuing in the tradition of naming its new fleet after significant and notable Italian sports people, and the flagship Airbus A350 is the third aircraft to debut in the latest colours. As new aircraft continue to become available from Airbus and leasing companies, the airline has promised it'll soon invite fans on its social networks to choose the names of the champions after whom the next aircraft with the new livery will be named. ETA expects to use the new aircraft to serve the carrier's long-haul network for its flagship product and had it painted in Toulouse, France. The new aircraft is set to return to the two cities previously connected by its predecessor Alitalia. From the first week of June, the airline will connect Rome Fiumicino International with Buenos Aires and Sao Paulo. While ETA has made no formal announcement, these flights are currently open to bookings on the carrier's website. If all goes according to plan, the airline will initially fly to Buenos Aires five times a week starting June 2nd and then increase the frequency to daily from August 1st. Similarly, its service to Sao Paulo will begin on June 1st and eventually increase to once daily from August 1st. The carrier has stated that it intends to expand its fleet up to 105 aircraft by 2025. Such a move would almost double the carrier's fleet from 55 aircraft, which is currently comprised of 18 Airbus A319s, 30 Airbus A320-200s and 7 Airbus A330-200s. What do you think of the ETA Airways blue livery? Are you a fan of the look? Or do you prefer Alitalia's green, white and red? Let us know by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.